Investigators in Chattanooga, Tennessee, are trying to figure out why a gunman attacked two U.S. military sites. The gunman killed four U.S. Marines before he was shot dead, apparently by police. Our nation mourns the loss, the census loss, of four of our nation's heroes. The FBI says it's examining everything about the gunman, identified as Kuwait-born 24-year-old Mohammed Youssef Abdulaziz. It says it's found no sign that he was connected to international terrorism or that he had help. There's no indication at this point that anybody else was involved. Police say Abdulaziz first attacked a recruiting center on Thursday morning, firing from inside his car. He took a shot and then it was a pause for about two seconds, and then it was just shot, 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 shot. The gunman then drove about seven miles, attacking a Navy Marine training center, getting out of his vehicle and killing the four Marines before he was killed. One Marine and one police officer were wounded. Abdulaziz lived in Hickson, a short distance from Chattanooga. Police swarmed the town. We are checking every possible place that he could reside or could have resided, visited uh, where he's shopped, where he he went to school, uh, who his friends were, if he worked out at a gym. At least two women were seen in handcuffs being led away from what was believed to be Abdulaziz's house. However, the FBI says it typically secures a scene when it's investigating. Violet Ekonomova, The Associated Press.